Hello everyone. So today we are going to work on this for uh, full body IK system based uh, standing uh, idle animation. So as you can see here, uh, when the character stops riding the bike, it key, uh, put one of the legs in the ground, but still keep the hands on the handlebar and also bike tilts a little bit to the right. So this is still driven by the full body, full body IK system that we have implemented using the control rig. Um, previously we had, we used an animation for this, but there we had some problems. So that's why I decided to go with uh, the control rig for the, uh, when the bike is stopped state also okay so let's see how to do this today okay so this is what we have at the moment uh, when the character stops uh, just go to an animation and here as the shortcomings uh, we have these problems in the hand uh, actually it's kind of okay but while I am in the in this mode if i use a od to turn the bicycle you can see hands are not moving anymore that's because the the animations are not driven by the full body ik system anymore it's just the it's just a regular animation so right so here is the bike blueprint and if i open the biker animation blueprint mm, here this is what i have done actually we did in the last episode so let me override this for now uh, let's just ignore this animation for now so i want to work on uh, when the bicycle is stopped bicycle is stopped the character should still uh, put one of the foot the right foot on the ground but it should be uh, driven by the control rig right so here i am using this lf rf locations using this get bike points through the bpi vehicle interface and i have implemented that interface function here so here we have this rf which stands for right foot uh, which is a scene component that I have attached to the pedals like this so I'll uh, add another scene component let me just duplicate this let's call it RFG which stands for right foot ground and uh, it should be outside the pedal so inside the bicycle mesh attached to the bicycle mesh um, let me place it in a location like this right uh, like this let's say okay now in the get bike points if the bike speed is below a certain value we can use the location of this RFG component uh, to drive the location of the right foot. So here, let me drag and drop this and get velocity, get vector length, and if this one is less than let's say 5 so we can do a selection select based on this node if it is true I can use RFG if it is false I can use RF now let me take test so as you can see now the character is keeping the right foot on the ground when it is stopped but that 
uh, it is not smooth at all because it just changes the um, it just changes the location without any lurping or anything so and also it's not perfectly uh, placing the foot on the ground that's partly because the character's uh, leg length is not enough so we may have to do some kind of a tilting of the bike when the character is stopped when the bike is stopped right but the other problem is solved see character is still keeping the hands on the uh, handle uh, when I rotate because uh, this is still driven through the animation uh, through the full body IK system okay now let's quickly do set up a way to uh, set the angle of the bike uh, actually we have already implemented this lean angle here update lean, inside this update lean angle function we implemented this uh, to use like this so as you can see here when the bicycle turns you can see the bicycle leans so for that purpose we implemented the lean angle so we can use the same thing so when the bike stopped if it leans to the right side it should look more believable so all I have to do is we already calculate the vector length and here let's add some value to this lean angle calculation and let's select this value that we add based on the speed so if the speed is less than let's say 5 I'll pick a so here let's use a value like 8 otherwise zero and let's use uh, the result of this addition as the new value for the lean angle so now when the bike is stopped it should have some angle like this and when the bike starts moving uh, it becomes straight see All right, and now what we need to fix is this uh, snapping of the leg. There should be some smoothness. The lean angle is already smooth because we have implemented that in such a way. We have a lurking in action here. So that's why lean angle doesn't snap. Right, now let's go to skip bike points so here let's expand no let's collapse this into a sub node get our location right foot location right now uh, if I expand this part oh wait right this is what happens inside that node and let's uh, promote this to a variable so that we can apply lerpy mm -hmm. not a local variable a global variable rf location Right. 
now without directly setting it oh wait this would be a problem because when the character uh, pedals faster uh, there could be a lag because of that so no we can't uh, use it that way so what we have to do is we can do some uh, we can do a lerp for linear interpolation for this transform right okay so instead of using this let me get the transform of the RF and transform of the RFG right and as for the alpha we can get the vector length if alpha is 1 if alpha is 1 we will have the output B here if alpha is 0 we will have the output as the output we will have A here so yeah instead of using a boolean let me divide this by let's say 5 yeah. or maybe 10 and let's clamp this value in between 0 and 1 so this will become 1 when the speed is higher than 10 so in that case we need to have the RF location RF transform in the other case if when it is uh, when the speed is lower than 10 that means character is going to stop we need to have the transform of right foot on ground right now we should see some smoothness better still it is a bit faster but if I make this instead of 10 50 Yeah, that's better. Yeah, okay. So the other problem is uh, now we don't have the reverse animation. So how do we solve that? let's leave it for the next episode all right and thanks for watching so for, uh, as always project files will be available for the download in the patreon page link would be in the description below and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club see you in another episode goodbye